I'm going on a cruise. I am so excited. We are going to Caribbean islands on a Norwegian uh, Encore. We've never been on the Norwegian cruise line, never. So it's going to be a new line for us, something to discover. And also Norwegian Encore, it's just almost a new ship. Uh, very famous for its uh, activities. So I am super excited. So I want to show you what I am going to pack for my seven days Caribbean cruise, how I'm planning to pack. I tend to overpack and to be honest, it's a holiday and I want to look good. When I look good, I feel good. Um, so, but I try still to bring not as much. <laughs> I just want to show you how I am planning my packing. So we live in Toronto and Toronto is cooler than Miami, of course. So when we are leaving from Toronto, it's beginning of March, it's still chilly. So what I'm planning to wear when we are leaving Toronto is uh, everything is comfortable and everything is stretchy. So, and I ha so I have these leggings, it's like uh, ripped material, very comfortable, stretchy. I wore it a few times before in my travels. Uh, they are from H&M. I have lots of pieces. Uh, I have lots of clothes from H&M and unfortunately I can't give you a link to it because I have it for a while. I have, I have it for years. So these particular pants I wore when we went to our South America trip, they are wonderful. Also, also because it's tend to be hot or cold, in the airport or on a plane. So I'm thinking to wear t-shirt and instead of sweater, I'm thinking to wear this, uh, it's like a cardigan, but it's like, it's like a jacket, jacket slash cardigan. It's, it's very comfy. Also, I wore it for a while. I wore it in, I wore it in a lot of my travels, but it's warm at the same time. It's like very soft. So if it's cold, I can keep it on. If it's hot, I tie it around my waist, you know, like, or, or put it in my backpack because it's, again, it's very soft. So it foldable, it folds nicely. It's, this piece is also from H&M a couple of years back. And of course, for my shoe wear, it's going to be my running shoes. They're very light, very, very comfortable. Um, when you're on a plane, you have to wear something like that, right? So when we arrive into Miami, it's going to be nighttime. So we're going straight to hotel and we're going to uh, sleep. And early in the morning, we're going to have breakfast and we're going to embark. So. For the embarkation day, and it because and because it's going to be warmer in Miami, but not hot as I checked weather. Maybe it's going it's changed, but by now it's going to be not very very hot. So um, I'm thinking I will change. I change to these pants also for, from H and M. They are very light and uh, very comfortable, stretchy material but they they a little bit fancier and they look nice. And I will keep a t-shirt and probably I will keep a cardigan just in case. I don't know how it's gonna be in the morning. And of course I'm, I'm gonna keep my running shoes on me as well. So when I'm packing, I pack separate uh, packing cube for my carry-on, for my backpack. Uh, which I take with me on the plane and in this uh, packing cube I usually pack extra socks, extra underwear and something like these pants uh, and extra t-shirt just in case to have it with me. I always do that and uh, it, in this case it will help also because like you know like who knows how it's gonna be uh, when we arrive in Miami and because it's going to be night and the suitcase situation, we'll see how it goes. 
So, embarkation day, busy day, we don't know when our cabin is gonna be ready. So this outfit, I think, gonna look nice, feel nice. And again, if I don't need this cardigan, I can put it in my backpack and again, feel nice and go around and see the ship. So next day is going to be a sea day. So of course, on the first sea day, we're going to relax and uh, maybe sleep in. So, and of course, when you wake up, you're going to a breakfast and there, uh, you can go to a buffet or you can go to a dining room. We usually go to a buffet. And I what I've heard and I've seen tons of videos, of course, before we we're going about this Norwegian Encore. It's beautiful, it's big, it's spacious, lots of to choose from. So um, in the morning, of course, you like you don't dress up, you just wear something comfortable uh, and going for a breakfast, but still you want to look nice, right? So for uh, so for the morning, I have this dress. This dress was great find from H&M. I love it. It's like a t-shirt dress. It's ripped material. It's so straight. It's not bodycon, so it doesn't, you know, show anything that I don't want to be shown. But it sits fine. And you can wear it, like, around the ship or to a breakfast or... you. I can dress it up a little bit, you know, put some jewelry and, uh, you know, like nice shoes and voila, it will be like a little black dress or a longer black dress in this case. My favorite. Love this dress. And then we'll see how it goes, uh, our sea day in a ship, we're probably, I'm gonna film something, we're going to go around, ship is huge, so we're going to discover the ship, um, we have cabin with the balcony, maybe we're going to sit on our balcony and enjoy the sun, so maybe a little bit of sunbathing, so for that, of course, I will have a uh, swimming suit, cover-up, something so i have a couple of cover-ups my favorites this is like um uh, it's like a dress again i can wear it around the ship or on a balcony or on a you know like on a sun deck it's really pretty and i can wear it just as a dress or with the swimsuit and it's very 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 light also I have this dress from the, I think from French Connection, and I think it's about 10 years old. <laughs> it's very, very old. It's a little sheer, little see-through, and it, it has a belt, and you wear it like that. So it's perfect for a beach or, again, to wear it on a ship, very bright colors. I still not sure if I'm gonna take it or not. We'll find out when I'm back and I'll make a video what did I wear or what I didn't. So stay tuned. So on the evening of that day, we are going to a specialty restaurant and it's going to be our wedding anniversary. So I am planning to wear something nice. So I'm still considering whether to take a dress with me I love this dress. I don't wear it enough. Uh, but the problem is that it wrinkles so easy. So we'll see. I'm still thinking if I should take it or not. But I really, really like this dress. And again, take it just for one evening. But this other case, why not? So I do have downy uh, wrinkle releaser. So we'll see. Maybe I will be brave enough and I will take this dress with me. But I have another option to take with me. I have this white Caprice, really, really nice. And they also, <laughs> I bought them years ago and they back in fashion, what do you know? So these Caprice, they look really nice with this T-shirt. And they have like open shoulder area, 
uh, and look how beautiful in contrast it looks so you know I, I like it as well so we'll see what I will end up taking and I don't have to worry about wrinkles much also these pants I can wear with this, all the rest of my t-shirts um, so we'll see and uh, I have lots of black t-shirts I have lots of black in my wardrobe so also it's gonna be it's gonna look really nice my uh, my white caprice and black t-shirts on tank something like that so next day it will be our first board day and we will be arriving to Dominican Republic and we bought an excursion hopefully everything goes well and weather is going to be nice so it's a little bit uh, of hiking and sightseeing and seeing nature and waterfalls so it sounds fun hopefully it will be fun so for that excursion uh, you know I'm thinking it's gonna be hot so we will need probably, and because it's going to be waterfalls, so we're going to wear uh, our swimming suit underneath something. Um, and what uh, me and my husband actually, we both going to wear a special wear to not get uh, sunburn. I bought myself this, I don't know, short cover up. It's like very thin material, it looks really nice. I can swim in it actually and, um, and when, you, when I'm gonna wear it, I'm gonna be protected from the sun and hopefully not to be sunburned and you know, for that reason I don't have to wear lots of sunscreen, which is good. So I'm thinking I will, I will wear that for sure. And with this I'm going to wear my denim shorts uh, which I'm not afraid to get wet or something because you know it's denim it can survive a lot for the shoes usually I don't like shoes with the open toes but this is another story because it's gonna be hot and sweaty uh, when you wear running shoes you need to wear socks or you know but with these sandals they are like feeling like a running shoes but they're sandals and again I can get like they're not waterproof but you know look at the how the the bottoms are like a, a running almost like a running shoe so inside they feel also nice so for that purpose only for that excursion I am taking these sandals with me also on this excursion I will take my bag i love this bag again i have it for a while now uh, it's very very good it, yeah, i can fit a lot in it my gear my maybe swimming suit of course water bottle and also i'm thinking maybe just in case that's my favorite phrase you will hear it lots of time just in case i'm thinking to take this uh, it's like a cover-up pants, very, very soft, uh, very like breezy, easy. Um, just in case, I'm thinking I'll take these pants with me. Again, they are fold like into almost nothing and I can fit them. I can fit them in my bag and, and actually a towel I might fit in this bag. But my husband also is taking his backpack, so we'll be fine with the towels. Um, like I said, it's very and it's a, a waterproof material, so I'm thinking I will be fine. So we're back on the ship, and um, we're gonna change to a dinner, maybe go to theater. We didn't plan it that much yet. One day we're going to theater and the other day we're going to dance, you know, like, I don't, I don't know what, how our day will go um, the rest of the day on the ship. So I'll just show you what I have. There is another, my favorite, favorite pair of pants. I don't remember when I got them from. So they, 
they are so light and again they're so easy to put on you don't need extra belt or anything they look fantastic also i'm tall so for me to find pants which are like right to the end <laughs> to the floor not always easy so i love these pants and i wear them forever so with these pants white is not always my favorite color so i have all kind of different t-shirts um and, and uh, tops like that for example and again it depends on the weather right so it's if it's going to rain or it's not it's it's i hope not so it's going to be chilly or not but look at the top i love this top it looks so nice and so summery so and you know what I'm, I'm thinking because like on the ship it's not always going to be it's usually ac is working and you never know is it cold or it's never warm never hot on a ship so usually we went to the colder climate uh, cruises i was taking with me cardigans or sweaters so this time i'm thinking it's a caribbean so hopefully the weather will be nice so i don't need really a sweater or a cardigan so i am thinking to take a jacket also from h&m you know h&m i'm loving h&m because everything like sleeves are long you know like everything fits my long tall body and this is very really light uh, i can fold it and put it in my suitcase and um you know like wear it in the evening it's gonna be nice it's gonna look nice and underneath i don't need to wear something long sleeve you know because it's it like it um suits it's used to purposes not very cold and also look very very nice and look how nice this is gonna be looking with this dress or with my red t-shirt or with the black t-shirt like i have like this very simple basic black t-shirt my pants and it's gonna be really nice i have another white pants they also my favorite and i bought them years ago from i think it was a banana republic they also really bit sheer that's why i i don't wear them very very often but they are wonderful in the summer and they also long and also they're going to be looking nice with my this top the silver top really nice and i have this top i also love it and it's beautiful and it's going to look nice with my black pants right so see there are lots of variation and then but again it's summer it's hot it's sweaty so i don't think i'm going to wear tops for example every day the same so that's why i'm bringing a variety but as i said i have uh, i have a lot of black <laughs> options um and i love them so i also have this cardigan but it's like nothing it, it doesn't it's not it's just for the decoration and the, maybe a little bit cover you know like but i wore it before it it, it again it's used its purpose because like in the summer this kind of cardigan is enough so our next stop is going to be saint thomas on saint thomas we also have an excursion plan and it's going to be like a snorkeling uh something on the water so again i am going to wear this is i'm going to wear always for my excursions on top of my swimsuits that's why i don't need a cover a lot of cover-ups so on top and because we're going to be on the water on the open sun i don't think i will wear shorts but i'm thinking i'll wear these pants again so uh 
I'm hoping it's gonna be fun and I'm hoping for the good weather because <laughs> I can't wait to go to uh, Caribbean and enjoy the sun and water. That's what we are going to for to Caribbean for, right? To enjoy all this. So I'm going to show you my new buy from the H&M. I think it's the perfect dress for the cruise. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's the open shoulder dress. So again, I can wear it um, after we are back from excursion um, for the dinner. And again, it's going to be beautiful. It's a little sheer, but not that much. And again, it's going to be beautiful with my jacket if I want to wear it in the evening. And I probably will because it's gorgeous. And it has like this bell sleeves. And again, I am tall. I'm 5'11", see? And it's like the length is right, the sleeves are, lengths are right, so I am, I'm loving And this is still on the website, that you still can find this dress. It's really, really, I love it. And a few years back, I bought this uh, one piece from the H&M. Why? Again, because look at the length, it goes right to the floor. So, and uh, I'm, like I bought it a few years ago, so I wore it and I wore it again because it doesn't wrinkle. I can take it everywhere with me and the, it's a nice design. I can wear a t-shirt with it or tank or blouse or some long sleeve. I can wear with this uh, one piece. Love it. So basically what I'm showing you uh, that's how I'm planning. And again, it, early in the morning, right when it's like, when we're going to excursion, there we're gonna, we're not going to have lots of time to change. So right in the morning, we're going to go early breakfast and then to excursion, right? So we're gonna dress right for the excursion. So um, maybe I'm not gonna wear it this cover for right for the breakfast so maybe i am going to wear a t-shirt and then take this with me and then change on the catamaran so that's what i'm thinking i will do and i can wear this and dry so quickly so i might you know just keep it on me while we're on catamaran our next stop is going to be Tartolo, British Islands, British Virgin Islands. And we are again uh, taking an excursion on a catamaran. We're going to swim and snorkel. Uh, I don't really remember right now like what exactly location we're going to do. But again, it's going to be sun and water. It's going to be beautiful. So again, I'm taking this with me because I don't want to burn because in, in our age, in like my age, after 50, we burn easily, we don't recover very fast and it's also, we have to be careful about our skin. It's not very safe to be under the sun for a long time, especially like close to water. So this is my safety net, but it covers just up to here. So I'm thinking maybe I will wear this one piece or for that occasion again I will wear some uh, swimsuit um, I will wear this one piece and then I will change into this cover up when we're going to swimming and sit on a catamaran while we're going you know on the water on our location uh, I forgot to mention on a St. Thomas we're going to stay it's going to be very long stay uh usually it's like around like four hours so we're on excursion we're back and we're leaving but on St. Thomas for some reason we're going to stay till the evening so I'm thinking we are going to back, uh, we'll return to this cruise ship we'll have lunch um rest you know like shower we'll, maybe we will change and going back to the town again just you know look around maybe maybe not who knows maybe we will have fun on the ship i don't know but if we do i will also take with me this black shirt 
I think they are more dressier and they have like quick, hi, there's my kitty, wants attention. Uh, so it's like a paperback uh, belt, like it's also nice and it's stretchy. And so with these, I, I can wear some crop top. Um, I actually have a crop top, like a black crop top. Again, I have lots and lots of black. Or I have long top, which is also my favorite, which looks like that, for example. Um, it looks like a dress almost, but I don't like, I like to wear something underneath. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, again, I might wear this dress. Um, I don't know. I, I just, I'm thinking, I'm planning. Hi. <laughs> and I'm showing you, um, uh, maybe you will, it, maybe it will help you in the future uh, to plan. Because like I said, I, am, I tend to overpack and I always like to take something with me you know, just in case. So if I take like the, I take two t-shirts, but I I want to take just in case another t-shirt because like, who knows what happened? You know, you can eat and something spill on yourself or, you know, like, <laughs> or uh, you will sweat so much so you can't wear this t-shirt anymore and, and things like that. I mean, you have to be ready for anything, right? Our next day, it's going to be at sea again. So we're going to have fun again. Uh, maybe play the laser tag, maybe go in, in uh, cars, you know, like, or virtual reality. There's, again, so much to do on this ship. And we're also going to the special, specialty restaurant this day. So again, I'm planning to wear something nice. So what I'm thinking, because I have so much black, I'm thinking to wear again, these white long pants with some of my uh, black, I love this top, black top, right? And to wear maybe this jacket again, See, when you have black and white, it's really easy to pair your clothes. So, yeah, and very, very versatile. But like I said, just in case, I have extra, just simple, basic tank tops uh, for, you know, like where we, maybe I will wear it uh, when we're going back to Toronto or I don't know, something, yeah, just in case, <laughs> I might use them. So our next and last stop is going to be private island. Perfect day on Coco Key, it calls, because Norwegian and the Royal Caribbean, they call differently. So, and I'm thinking I will wear a swimming suit, of course, and I think this dress, or this one. Again, I didn't decide yet if I'm taking both or just one of them. You'll see on my next video and when I'm going to unpack and I'll tell you what I used or not because like seven days with one hand it seemed like a not a long cruise but with other hand you know when last time you were seven days it felt like it lasted like a two weeks because like you know, you're on the sea, you're enjoying yourself. So, of course, I can take just a minimum and wear it all the time. But, you know, again, it's a vacation. And like I said, when I look good, I feel good. And I also want to feel comfortable. And I, I want to know that if something happens, I have backup. So, talking about backup. Of course, I have to take with me some long sleeves. So again, I have this um, just basic, it's uh, long sleeve. And because we're cruising, you know, it has to be this. Um, again, in the evening, just in case, maybe, hopefully it's not, but maybe if it rains 
or this very very thin, very very like thin thin sweater. But again, it's a long sleeve, and um, I find it's useful to have something with me. I don't know yet if I'm going to take this with me or not. Also, H and M, it's almost like a vintage now because I have it like maybe 10 years, I don't know, but uh, it's really nice, it still holds itself really, really nicely, and um, maybe I'm thinking to take it, uh, to wear it when I am, we're going back, maybe, maybe not, maybe I will not take it with me, I didn't decide yet, but I want, again, I want to be sure that I have a backup, and of course, just in case, I will have one pair of jeans with me, you know, you have always to have something, you know, for the chilly weather because you never know, but I hope I won't be needing it, but I am taking it with me. As you can see, <laughs> it's like, I can, even if I take less, I can build really nice, I can build really nice outfits, but just in case, I will take with me some extra t-shirts. I also have like this cami also from the H&M. I, I can wear this and, and a jacket. And you know, I, I hope I will get tanned a little bit. This is gonna be really looking nice with the tan. Also, I have this shirt. I, I, use, I use it as a cover-up all the time. It's like a little gauzy, uh, nice color, really light. Will I take it with me? Not sure yet because I am taking with me this short. This is cozy, soft, like really nice. And again, it's nice to wear it around the ship uh, because jacket is better for the evening. But this, if I'm a little chilly on the ship during the day, I can wear this with my t-shirt and feel comfortable. Um, so, and this is another example of what I have, like it's a t-shirt, it's not a dress, it's a t-shirt, but again, it doesn't wrinkle, so I always take it with me and I love it. I can wear it with the shorts, with the pants, you know, and it looks nice. Okay, that's about what I'm going to wear uh, on different court days and uh, on the beach. On the beach, of course, I will take again this cover because again, I don't want to get burned. And it's cool. It feels cool when you're wearing it under the sun. It feels cool. It's really nice. So, uh, and, and like I said, uh, I'm, I, I'll take some of the dresses. This I will wear on the beach, but uh, maybe I will wear it back to the ship, or maybe I'll take it. I don't know, because uh, the uh, unfortunately there is no docking, so we will have to take a tender. Uh, so I don't think I will wear it right in the morning again. I will probably take it with me and I will wear a dress. So to be safe, again, we will have to wear hats. So I am taking two hats with me. I am taking this one, it's really nice. And what I do usually, because you know, you sweat and the uh, hat is not easy to clean, I wear a bandana and then I wear a hat. That way, uh, hat will sit better on me. And also, I don't get uh, hot dirty because, like you know, you uh, I usually put some sunscreen on my face, and it gets into the hat. I don't want like I want my hat to last a little longer, so I I usually wear bandana. And for the excursion, maybe um, I will take uh, this hat. Uh, we'll see what what feels better. So I'm taking two hats with me. Also, I'm taking a couple of scarves with me. Again, maybe I won't feel like uh, wearing a jacket, for example. 
I, I, I can take a scar and uh, use it as a, as a, you know, like a cover up, like, uh, you know, if I feel chilly or, you know, like where it, like, <laughs> something, you know, like fun. I don't know. And I like scarves anyway, so I, I always take it with me. Maybe I won't need it and maybe they will just stay in the packing queue. Who knows? So that's it about the clothes. Now about the shoes. Of course, we need the flip flops to wear on a, you know, on a deck, on a, when we're going on a beach. Um, it's, they're very light again, they're very, it's, it's, um, it's a Birkenstocks. I love Birkenstocks. They are almost, I don't know, six years old or closer to that. They are nice. They don't hurt. There is nothing to hurt and they um, like feel nice on the foot. Very comfortable. A little bit bulky, but I love them. Um, perfect, like again, like when you go on the beach or on a, like, this snorkeling excursion, I will probably wear this. On a ship, I always wear tongs. I love tongs. Like I said, I don't like sandals. I don't like open toe shoes most of the time. So my husband as well, we like this tongue slip one. So that's uh, what we're wearing on the ship 100% of the time. When we're walking around the ship, especially in sea day or like during the day, I would say, right? So for the evening wear, uh, I have these dance shoes. We are dancers, like we're not professional dancers or anything like that, but we, we, we like to dance. Um, uh, and uh, I have these dance shoes. I actually bought it for my daughter's wedding because dance shoes are the, are the most comfortable. So we are hoping to find on the ship a uh, nice dance floor. And so we will be able to dance. We dance like it's a West Coast swing. It's not a ballroom or anything like that. Uh, maybe a little bit of waltz, <laughs> but they are uh, uh, dance shoes. And I wore them on our previous cruise as a evening wear. Very comfortable, very nice little heel. I love them, but just in case, I will take with me this flat, uh, uh, my shoes, um, just in case if my feet get tired of the heel because usually I don't wear heels uh, and they are nice, I can dance in them as well, but preferably dance, I, I will be dancing in my dancing shoes, but just in case I will have my shoes, uh, my extra shoes. And of course I will take my slippers for the cabin to, you know, like not to walk around like bare feet or anything like that. They're nice and soft. And of course, that will, I will take with me on the all excursion where we're going to see uh, waterfalls or swimming or something. These are my red shoes. Um, I probably need to buy new ones, but they're, they, this is, I have to have it. Honestly, they pack really light really like skinny they don't take lots of space in your suitcase but if you're going to a caribbean you need to have them 